not only that energy, but it is definitely she's not just a mother, but she's also a grandmother, right? Kind of body, kind of, you understand that? Okay. She's in a very small lady. She's very short lady. She said forward with the yes. And then she stepped forward to come in. She said to me, she said, it's so lovely to see you sitting here today. Now, I don't know if this is your daughter and this is your granddaughter, but this is what she was referring to as she was talking and she's going, it's lovely to see the generations, and that's when she made the reference of the generations. Do you understand this? So she was acknowledging all the generations here, and especially the little one there. So it was just a pleasure to see her um, and be able to remember to her. Okay? And as she steps forward with me, she's saying to me, do you understand um, that does anyone remember you do origami or play with like fold paper or have this interest in doing paper? Because she was actually showing me this beautiful little swan that was made with origami. Can you understand this? Okay, it's fine. Um, she was bringing it in, she was bringing this little swan, it's like a swan, and the swan seemed very symbolic to her, but it was, she was saying origami, they are paper, they are paper working, and they are creative. So she's giving me a very creative energy. Can you understand that with you? Yep, thank you very much. She's also showing me that she, that she would knit, so I feel that she was very much a knitter, that she's some evidence to know that she is with you, okay? And that she is here today to say hello to you. But this lady is a very beautiful lady, she stepped forward in a very lovely spirit, but she said that you are very much like her, and that you have that same gentleness, calmness, and you bring that to the family. Can you understand that? And then you give your right arm if it was asked of you, and there would be no stopping you, okay? And she's acknowledging your kindness, your love, and she's bringing that into the world. Blessings and she could not let me go anywhere. I had to come to you. So when she made up her mind, she was very, very um, adamant that that was how it should be today. Okay? Now she's telling me to say to you that there's a situation, she said, take two steps to the side and just allow it to unfold. You can't change it, so just allow it. Do you understand what she's talking about? Two steps to the side, allow it to unfold, and it will unfold, and you have to trust. And she's taking care of it on the spirit side. Okay? She loves you very much. She's with you an awful lot. And I don't know, she said, you're going to buy new towels. Okay. <laughs> that's what she gave me. She said, that's what she's giving you as a little Mother's Day present to you. You're going to get some nice new towels. And I'll leave that with you. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> God bless. It's interesting what they'll bring through. But they know you're shopping lists and they know other people. So just hold it if you can't stand at the moment. Okay? Thank you. All right. As I come over here, I'm very much drawn. Ah, the lady with the grey just at the back there. Could it grey jump? Yes. Can yes. I come to you, please? Yes. Thank, thank you very much. Can I have your name? Sylvia. Sylvia? Thank you. Well, Sylvia, if you are a gentleman, and he's just accepting forward, this gentleman in the spirit realm, he comes in very much on father's side of the family and he feels very much fatherly, although he says he's not your father, okay? He comes in and he steps to the side, so he's like one generation back, grandfather, father side in the spirit realm. Can you understand this gentleman? Thank you very much. Now, if you notice my energy has just shifted and it's become very, very strong and very direct and very to the point. This is because he stepped very close into my energy, okay? And he's really wanting me to let you know that he is with you today, okay? Not only him, but I also hear the word brother, so I don't know if he's got a brother, but there's certainly he's referring to a brotherly type of energy coming in around you. Can you understand this with yourself? Thank you very much. This gentleman, as he steps forward with you, was a very kind, very generous, and very giving man, although he says that he was very closed off in a lot of ways because of the era he was brought up in. Can you understand that with you? Would you understand that I've just seen smoke? Um, it's almost like I'm either smoking a cigar or there's something going on, and then he's smoking, whether that was in his younger years, but he's bringing that forward. Did you know that of him? Okay, well, he's bringing, I actually feel that he enjoyed a really good cigar, okay? Now, I don't know if he did it all the time, but he certainly did have that smoke, and he just wanted you to be aware and maybe to ask for some confirmation, okay? He's telling you that there is an event coming up around you. It's almost like a night out. I see you standing in a beautiful dress room. I see you with a beautiful, nice glass of red wine or some kind of drink that you would be having. And they say that you would be going out. It would be quite formal. Can you understand? Is there an event coming up around you? Well, he's telling me to tell you he's coming along with you. So don't drink too much because he's watching you. Okay? Right. So um, I'll leave him with you with that because it was just a recognition today. That's what he wanted. He just wanted to be remembered and to tell you that although the generations in the past have gone, they don't stop loving you and they don't stop guiding you. So ask him for help and protection and he will always be with you. May I leave him with you with a lot of love. He bends over, gives you a kiss on the head and says he's 
going to stay with you for the remainder of the afternoon. Leaving with you, thank you very much for please. Okay. Oh, I'm going to pull it over to this side. Okay. So I'm going to work a little bit differently at the moment because I'm not actually being given a place I want to particularly go to, but I have this gentleman. And I choose to trust what spirit of being because I like to deliver it the way they like to deliver it. They all have their own personality. So I have a tall gentleman. He has quite dark hair. And this gentleman was not a big man in his build. He was quite um, thin in his build, but he was certainly around about 5 foot 10 to 5 foot 6 type of um, high frame. I feel he went very quickly, and I also felt that he brought in some headaches, some illness, and quite a bit of problems with his health at the end. And it was quick, fast, and he went down. Can anyone understand this gentleman? You can understand this gentleman. Okay. Thank you very much. Because he wasn't actually pulling me to any particular person. He just wanted me to describe him, to get him placed. Okay? So as he steps forward, he steps forward and he brings with me um, a feeling that there's some kind of jewellery or there's something like a gold chain or there's something that's significant in connection to this gentleman. Can you understand this? It's a piece of gold jewellery. Yes. Yes, thank you very much. That's just confirmation that he's with the right person. He's the room. Okay. Right, so as he steps forward, it's like, I am your best friend. I'm your best friend. How about that? Okay. No, it's very coming in and saying that like, he's your best friend. And it's almost like he's made a pinky promise that he will always be with you, looking over you, and guiding you. And I feel like this is his energy that he had in life. He was very much a protector type of energy, looking after people, taking care of them, and he really wants to bring that to you today. That he's taking that on board even in the spirit realm, okay? Now, I don't know if you have anything to do with that. I randomly threw in something to do with like a tractor or something to do with some kind of farming <coughs> out towards the country, that kind of dynamic as he steps forward. Can you understand this is a connection with his family? Going back, there's something to do with going out and into the country. And he showed me like a tractor that with the big tires and doing that kind of, that, well, country thing. Can you understand this? Thank you. Because that is what he showed me, and it was just very much a picture. Thank you very much. Okay, so that's where that would be placed. This gentleman has the most amazing personality. He has, he's bright, he's sharp, he's happy, and he just brings that to you. He wants you to have that. He does not want you to get lost in sadness, regrets, emotion. He wants you to be happy, vibrant, and enjoy your life. That's why he's here today, and he is energy filled with that. Okay? He loves you very much. He's always with you. He's guiding, and he will always take care of you. May I live here with you with a lot of love. God bless. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, I've got to ask them where I want to be drawn. I'm not sure if it's this way or this way. Are you together? <laughs> because I'm going to bed. Are you like connected as in family or just really close friends? So I feel like I might be here, but if it fits with you, please, there's a good energy connection here, okay? Alright, so the first thing that I've been impressed with with you is that there's a lady stepping into the okay? So I have a lady. Now I actually think this lady looks very much like you. I think that this lady comes in very much with you in some regards. Um, even down to height, even down to she really just feels very much like I'm looking at you and I do feel like I'm coming in on a mother vibration, okay? So I have two mother in the spirit realm because I feel like I've got mother in spirit. And did your mother look very much like you because that's <coughs> she's bringing that to me? Oh, okay. Well, I, I feel like this lady is saying that she is very, <coughs> she's very much like you. You are very much like her. That's what she wants, right? Very much, okay? So I am here with you, all right. Okay, now what she brings in, do you understand the voice and singing? Do you like to sing? Can you understand, do you put the music on your man or stand in front of a room full of people? But do you understand a liking for music and to sing? Can you understand that? I can't sing very well. You do sing. 
she just telling me that you were turning the music on and you were belting it out and I feel that she was standing there and she was listening and she was having a really good sing along with you and it felt like the arms were going up in the spirit realm and she was singing along with you and she was really enjoying it and she was enjoying the music. Could you understand that? Because that's what she's bringing in around you. Okay. So I need to say to you that she takes me back to when you were quite a young child, okay? And as she's taking me back, it's almost like she's taking me back into a family holiday and I want to go back and I feel like I'm at the seaside. I feel like there's beach, there's, there's um, sand, there's water, there's a whole lot of that going on. Family, fun, sun, sand and that kind of energy. Can you understand that with her and your family? Can you understand going back to when you were very young that there would have been a family time which would have been very much a part of you know that happy time, happy family, and it's like going back in time when you were quite young when you would have done that. There might be pictures and it's a big ball that she's showing me and it's one of those old-fashioned balls and it's got the red and it's got the yellow, that sort of colouring, that type of thing, and it's like we're playing at the beach and we're very young, okay? She's, she's just showing me that picture and it's like she wants to take me back to that time, okay? So that's what she's bringing in. She's also bringing it in that the, with the whole family holidays in the past, it's like I want to bring you into a, fan, like a holiday in the future. So I, I've got this energy of travel coming in around you and going away. And that's why she's making this reference point. Can you understand this? Do you have a plan to go away? Because I feel like, well, I'm going to say to you, okay, I'm asking her. She's saying six months, okay? It will be very quick. It does not have to be overseas or any of that kind of thing. Thank you very much. And she says you're going. And she's, it's like you can wait away when you're little. It's time to be going away again and enjoying yourself, okay? So that's the reference point to that, all right? That's coming in around you and it's very much available to you. And the funds will be available to you as well. That's what she wants you to know, okay? Very much so. She's around you. And she's bringing in her love for you today. She's also saying that she is, I feel like she wants to say she was sorry she left. She's sorry she left and she left you alone. That's what she felt like she was saying. That's what she wants to say to you. So I don't know if you can understand that, but I have to give that to you, okay? And that she has always loved you, no matter what went on, no matter what happened. She has always loved you and you were always in her heart, even if it wasn't always showing do you understand that? Thank you. That's her message today. That's, the, that's why she is here today. Okay? And she wants you to know that. Whether you accept it or not, that's up to you. That's what she says. But that's what she wants you to know from her side. So I will leave that with you, if I may, with a lot of love and many blessings from her. Thank you. Have a good one, guys. One more. Thank you. Okay. Okay, where am I going? Um, okay, the lady at the back um, with the... Yes. <laughs> You've caught my energy in my eye. I can see you better from here. Okay, make that connection. Can I have your name, please? Anthea. Anthea. How are you today, Anthea? Good start. Good to hear that. Okay. Who have I got for you? I have two stepping forward to you. Very parental. Is your parents in the spirit realm? Okay, well, they're very parental. So I feel like they're together. They come together like husband and wife. Okay, so they've been really married couple and they've stepped forward together. Now, the lady who steps forward, first of all, she's the one who steps forward, first of all, because that's her kind of, that was their relationship. She was the one who would step forward. He's the one who would be a little bit more behind. That's the energy that they're bringing forward. Okay, now she's a short lady. Alright, and as she steps forward, she has like a, one of those, you know those dresses that older ladies type of wear, that kind of dress? So she looks, to me as I look at her, quite grandmotherly, that feeling comes in with that dress and the way she's presenting herself. The gentleman was a bit taller, okay, and um, as he steps forward, he was very, well, you know, they really do scream grandmother and grandfather type of look to them, um, you know, the pants. Trouser pants, the shirts, the whole thing, skin down to the cardigan, that kind of feeling that comes in with them both. You can understand it? <laughs> Thank you. So, are they your grandparents? <laughs> okay. But they're also parents, okay? So, they come in with that energy around you, alright? And I do feel like when you were younger, they would be very much in your life because that's what they're telling me. And that's when they would have been quite um, protective of you. And they would have looked down 
love to you very much. Do you understand this? Yes. Okay, so you can understand that they bring the energy of the parent of parental energy. And that seems to be the key to this reading is they want you to know that they have not stopped looking after you and that they are with you. Now, you have big decisions to make and it's going to be life changing. You're worried you're going to make the wrong choice. Well, you'll still get to where you're meant to be. So, go with what's in your heart, not what everybody else is telling you. Don't follow logic and reason. Go with what you are being guided and you will get there faster. If you listen to others, you will be taken off the track to come back to it at a later date. Trust it. You know this. So just do it. Bottom line, today is about just doing it. Take the first step, make that happen, and follow it. And don't listen to any of the others around you who will lead you up the primrose path. Right? And when you get there, they're waiting for you, right where you're meant to be. And they're not telling me what it is, because it's none of that business. It's for you. Alright? But they are with you. And that, so ask them, and are feathers significant to you? Because they place a feather. And when you see the feather, whoop, you've got shivers, you'll know it's their sign. Yes? Excellent. Good stuff. Well, now there's nothing stopping you. Look for the feathers and you will know that that will be confirmation that they're there. They love you. They are always going to love you. They will never leave you and your family. Not just you, everyone. And they are going to be guiding you. And you have the most beautiful. 